back to the channel of Pro Enzo Vids, and this afternoon's video is some uh, news about regarding former Bulldogs player Adam Elliott. So as we know, Adam Elliott was playing at the Bulldogs until he, you know, eventually got sacked by a club after you know facing multiple drama uh, in the past. But then most recently, his um, recent you know um, issue and most recent um, situation that got him sacked by the Bulldogs and. You know, there's some news regarding about him right now, and that news is um, probably some good news in his favour, but also a bit risky at the same time. But um, yeah, um, Adam Elliott has got a lifeline for next year. He's been signed on a cut price deal by um, Canberra Raiders. The Canberra Raiders have um, have signed Adam Elliott on a 12 month contract, meaning for only one season. So for the 2022 season, that's it. Um, yeah, I think um, I think. Adam Melly going to a team like Raiders is good because he gets out gets out of Sydney. I think Adam Melly needs a fresh start out of Sydney, and yeah, he's going to be moving to Canberra, which is out out of Sydney, uh, and, and that's probably good for him. I think that's good for him and probably his family as well because um, when 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 you, when you think about it, um, Adam Melly is from Tarthra, and Tarthra is like in the south coast. I mean, I've been there before, and it's not far from Canberra, so I guess maybe Adam Melly being going going to, going to Canberra. I uh, would be yeah would be good for his family because he's gonna be closer to Tafra where you know his family is and where he was uh, raised. So yeah, I think it's um personally a good move for Adam Elliott, but it's risky for the Raiders in signing a player like him who's had drum before. But yeah, I think in terms of uh, a fresh start and where he's moving to the particular area, I think it helps Adam Elliott a lot in that case. But um yeah, look you know I think it's it's very unfortunate how his time at the Bulldogs ended, but you know. Um, just the thing is, you know, you've only got a couple of um, chances at, at one club and don't ruin them. And unfortunately, that's what Adam Elliott did. You know, he fucked up the first time, then the second time, then the third time. You know, he's had, there's just too much drama about Adam Elliott at the Bulldogs. So I feel like he had to leave the club and get a fresh start elsewhere. And he's going to get that at the Raiders now. So, yeah, I just want to say good on Adam Elliott. I hope he goes well at the Raiders. And I think he will. I think under Ricky, he should go okay. Um... And you know, I don't know how many games he might get at Canberra. He might, he might just start off the bench. I believe. I don't think he's going to go there to start as a. Not. I don't think he's going to go there to be a starting player. But he might play off the bench or might just be a backup player. But yeah, seriously, if you think about it, Adam Elliott is Adam Elliott is a first grade player. But you know, just I guess with, I guess with how many other good young forwards the Raiders do have at their club, it might you know put Adam Elliott behind the pecking, pecking order of forwards, but you never know. He could actually find a spot somewhere in the team, but we have to wait and see what Ricky does. But, yeah, um, you know, interesting pickup for the Raiders. Um, there was talk that maybe the Tigers or the Warriors could have signed Adam Elliott, but I think Raiders Raiders is right is the right choice, and um, hopefully it all works out well for Adam Elliott. Hopefully he can stay out of trouble or any sort of drama when he's at Canberra. So, um, yeah, all the best to Adam Elliott, and hopefully... He um makes the most of the of the opportunity that, that the Raiders have given him for the 2022 season. But guys, thanks for watching. What are your thoughts on the Raiders signing Adam Miller on a one year contract? Do you like it or do you dislike it? Let me know in the comment section down below. But yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you soon in another video.